this is George from High Tech Legion. Today we're going to be taking a look at the first two entries in Thermaltake's Water 2.0 line, the Water 2.0 Performer and the Water 2.0 Pro. Both of these pieces are self-contained liquid cooling units. Typically when you think of liquid cooling, uh, you're going to think of a lot of pieces, a lot of gadgets, whatnot, but the new self-contained liquid cooling units are very, very easy to maintain, uh, require no maintenance at all actually, easy to install, and basically uh, just a one piece, you know, going that's going to be no more difficult to get in there than uh, most of your standard air coolers. Taking a look as we see both pieces, uh, typical thermal take fashion, black box, really nicely packaged with a good looking picture of each on the front. Now, essentially these are the same unit. The only difference between them, the Water 2.0 Pro is a step up. It has a slightly thicker uh, fin array and coil system, which we're going to take a look at. Otherwise, same pump, same fans, same all around. Uh, they use the same PWM fans that are going to be controlled by the heat of the CPU itself. There is no control software. Moving around the back of the boxes, we get a closer look at some of the features. They are exactly the same feature layout as we had said, only difference being the Pro is going to call out the thicker radiator uh, benefits the larger cooling surface. Uh, other than that, same features, high performance copper plate to accelerate heat conductivity, high reliability low profile pump, pre-filled coolant reduces liquid replenish, uh, replenishment hassle, low evaporation tube, reduces loss of cooling, effect, uh, loss of cooling effectively, high tech sealed circulation system. As I say, the Pro does call out the thicker radiator. Powerful fan blows the heat of uh, radiator out the chassis to maximize cooling performance. Uh, very nice. This actually takes the place of your rear exhaust fan or uh, any exhaust fan you would like. So you're actually effectively just replacing a fan. So it's going to be a bit lower noise as well. You're not adding fans. Dual automatic adjustable 120 millimeter PWM fans maximize cooling. PWM control function fan 1200 to 2000 RPM. Universal socket compatibility and accessory package. Uh, it does fit Intel LGA 2011, 1366, 1155, 56, and LGA 775. Of course, it also supports AMD FM1 and the AM2, AM3 set. Heading inside the boxes, we get a look at the two units. As you can see, by comparison, the Pro uses a much thicker fin array and coil system than the Performer. That is going to be the only difference between the two. Otherwise identical, same tubing, same pumps. So let's take a look at the Pro. As you can see, large radiator with the coils going through. The actual workings of the unit itself are very, very simple. The pump has the cooling block, which is going to sit directly on the CPU. Liquid is going to be flowing over the copper block. As the pump pumps it, it will move out into the radiator, through the coils, through the fins, and back over onto the copper block after it's cooled. Obviously, two fans, dual fan setup, are going to sit on each side of the radiator, moving the air through, cooling the liquid. Looking at the construction of the Thermaltake Water 2.0, you've got very nice construction. First thing you notice, uses rubber tubing rather than segmented tubing. Very flexible, easy to work with. Uh, if you've ever used segmented tubing, you know it can be very, very difficult to work with. Hard to get your uh, cooling block into place as it will not freely bend. Uh, Thermal Take is taking care of this. Rubber tubing, extremely flexible. Pump itself, very, very simple unit. Nice copper bottom with Tim pre applied to the copper base. Very simple, sits against the CPU. The pump itself, there is absolutely nothing to it. No moving parts, just Thermal Take Water 2.0 logo. Nothing to touch, nothing to play with. Your power input comes off of there. Taking a look at the fin and coil assembly, as you can see, very, very dense fin assembly with horizontal 
coils going through that the liquid's going to pass through in order to cool. Naturally, as we had said, two 120 millimeter fans are included, 1200 to 2000 RPM, four pin connector naturally since it's PWM, black, white blades. Taking a look inside the accessory box, warranty card, installation manual, which is illustrated. As I say, it is a, actually a very, very easy installation and illustrated all the way through for each and every different socket. Your various nuts and bolts for the different uh, sockets you'd be using. Intel backplate, AMD backplate, Intel retaining ring, 2011 retaining ring, AMD retaining ring, and Y adapter for the two fans. The Thermaltake Water 2.0 Pro and Performer are very nice looking units, um, self-contained liquid coolers, absolutely maintenance free, both using dual fan, which is a little bit different from what we've seen in the past. Uh, most of the entry level pieces we've seen only use a single fan. Dual fan typically is moved into in the higher line, and of course the Pro does offer that, as well as a much thicker radiator. Uh, all copper contact block, PWM fans 1200 to 2000 RPM. Very full featured, very functional looking units.